Hey guys, Wedgerox here from Rocket League Mods. Just going to do a quick tutorial today on applying textures from the game engines into your scene with your meshes. So I'm just going to do it on custom meshes today. So, first off, open up your content browser and then find the mesh that you want to import. So mine's under my test level package, my boost pad. I'm just going to pop that onto the scene and then you find whatever material that you want to use it with so I'm just going to use a generic cube material so there we have that so now all we have to do is build the scene this is probably the longest part of the whole tutorial yep make sure there's no errors all good save the scene and then you have to find this package, whatever one you used, sorry, whatever package you used, whatever materials they come from, you have to find that package inside your Explorer window. So mine is here. So if I go into my local disk, UDK, engine, because that's the heading that it's saved under, content, it'll have all the packages in there. So if I grab my engine materials, copy that, and put it into my mods folder, so I've already got it in here, then that way this file, which is my level, knows that it has to reference the engine materials to get the texture and the test level package, which is the package that I custom made to get the meshes. Right. So make sure that when you copy a map in, of course, you change the extension to UPK from UDK, otherwise it won't load. Okay. So next up, just going to quickly go in-game and make sure that it's working. So I go down, open up Rocket League. Oops. There we go. Now I'm going to drive over. And there it is. Okay, so as you can see, there's curved surfaces here as well. These are working properly, just like how I did them in my tutorial. So I can drive up them, boost off them, whatever, all good. This one's invisible, I think. Yeah, not invisible, not colliding. So that's it. That is exactly how you're supposed to apply your textures.